sure too it was a success. I saw all the big names, artists pop up and all yeah. that. How did you feel about it? You know, the whole acceptance. You having the artists also come turning for you on that big day. How was it like? I was very happy and that has to be one of the best birthday presents I ever had to party with my fans and to have them sing along my songs and also to have all these big acts grace the stage with me I have to say it's one of my best birthday experiences ever great so we've been following your progress first it was you know you talking about you completing school now school is you know you yeah it's still in section all right no I'm done with you're school done now. with school yeah. right now so then how would you rate it you know when you are in school the pressure that comes with it isn't like now you are more dedicated there's more time to do music and all that yeah yeah so when i was in school it was the pressure was wesser <laughs> the pressure is getting, <laughs> pressure is getting wesser. yeah it was it was very tight for me as at that time because i had to be doing school and then music but now i'm i can say like you mentioned my attention is now fully focused on the music Till I get stable feet and then I, I divert my attention to something else. So will Jackie be going back to school still or are you just going to dedicate some years to the good music? I mean sometime in the future I'm looking forward to doing some courses as well. It's not bad to try something. You know. Yeah, but for know. now I'm just doing the music. Great. So we love your style, absolutely. We've seen celebrities, artists, you know, everybody got their brand. But I would say yours is modest. Like I don't really, see, is, it, is, it, is it intentional that you don't want to show skin, you don't want to go all sultry? Like, how how do you do it and i know some people too in this space they maybe they were expecting like oh sex sells you have to show skin and all that but you are too in this line i know you're comfortable with whatever you wear mm -hmm. on stage so how has it been having to you know do you in this industry yeah that's that's exactly what i was about to say that i wouldn't say i wear this and i don't wear that i just wear what makes me comfortable so anything that i wear out there is what makes me i don't like to wear outfits that's going to put me through stress and all that so whether it's decent or not decent whatever i have on is what makes me comfortable so yeah great so you are one of our very best everybody talking about when you're talking about artists in ghana you cannot complete a equation without putting on jackie from humble beginnings it didn't take you like you know like three years or anything mm -hmm. to get your breakthrough everybody's talking about you globally not each here just mm -hmm. here in ghana how did you manage to break through especially in uh, nigeria which is you know one of the biggest markets mm -hmm. yeah um it's a lot it's a lot more than just getting hearing the name everywhere there was a lot of hard work that was done behind the scenes we really did a lot of work to push the song to push the name to push the brand and when we did that it was able to reach a certain point where everybody started hearing of jackie music and loving the songs and aside that to the music was good so anybody that heard it from the get-go fell in love with it okay great so i haven't heard you complain about the lack of support but then some female artists have talked about you know the industry not really supporting do you think that that work has been done now it's a free space everybody's exploring you're also having your shine in terms of like female musicians yeah the industry has always been a free space i feel like it's always about how hard you push yourself and when it comes to if i should categorize the females mm -hmm. i should say that there's a lot of work that also needs to be done because we need more females in the industry and i feel like um the females also we do need to be heard a lot more in the industry that's the, the that's what I can say. so but before we wrap up how important is it you know we're going for a black coach event we've seen a lot of artists pass through how is it important to have a show and have your colleagues turn up to that event it's a very good feeling and it's important because you as the artist hosting the show it makes you understand that or you have some people that are willing to come through to come and grace your, your stage for you as well and it also makes the entire event entertaining mm -hmm. the more so it's always nice to be passing through shows for your fellow artists anytime that you have the means and the chance all right so final one your show we saw kim promise and you know r to be passed through and then there was this comments from Chris Wado that they were expecting that they would pass. I don't know if you've heard about it, but if not, this week has been buzzing with that whole thing. Okay, they should have passed through. When you received the message, how did you, how did you feel about it? I would absolutely not want to touch on that you don't want at to touch all. It. Thank you very much, Songbear. <laughs>